Ten years after the Columbia disaster, a NASA employee, Wayne Hale, has made some sensational revelations about that ill-fated day. The Columbia crew had no idea that they were facing imminent death. NASA chiefs decided not to tell them. The news came on a day of the memorial service at Florida's Kennedy Space Center to mark the disaster's 10th anniversary. Seven astronauts had died when their craft burned up in the atmosphere over Texas after a 16-day mission. Mission Control suspected the shuttle's heat shield had been damaged, but the crew had no way of repairing it. They would have run out of oxygen in orbit before a rescue or upon re-entry into the Earth's atmosphere. Now, Wayne Hale, who went on to become the Space Shuttle Program Manager, made the revelations on his blog. He said, Flight Director John Harpole told him, and I quote here, You know, there is nothing we can do about the damage to the thermal protection system. If it has been damaged, it's probably better not to know. I think the crew would rather not know. Now, Harpole further asked Hale, Don't you think it would be better for them to have a happy, successful flight and die unexpectedly during entry? rather than to stay in orbit knowing that there was nothing to be done until the air ran out. All seven astronauts, Kalpana Chavla, David Brown, Rick Husband, Laurel Clark, Michael Anderson, William McCool and Ian Ramon died within minutes. The shuttle exploded at 200,000 feet.